Um, so I'm not surprised by all this James Corden information coming out because if you are rude to one server, you are absolutely rude to many servers. Like that is not just like a one-off, I was having a bad day kind of thing. That's like, you are trash. So here's my James Corden story. And he's telling James Corden that he can get him a reservation, you know, right when they open. Um, he was trying to be really accommodating. And James Corden yells at this bus boy. A lot of good that does me, mate. A lot of good that does me. Another celeb is under fire after James Corden was exposed by Becky Habersberger, wife of Try Guys member Keith Habersberger. At first, Becky accused the host of yelling at a busboy in broad daylight. Still, it seems like this is no isolated case because another witness stepped forward and yep, they confirmed that Corden was very rude in person and would yell at servers one too many times. Do you want to hear her very own James Corden story? Then keep watching. James Corden was first called out in a post by Keith McNally, owner of popular New York eatery Balthazar, where he said, James James Corden is a hugely gifted comedian, but a tiny cretin of a man, and the most abusive customer to my Balthazar server since the restaurant opened 25 years ago. And we walk by Little Dom's, and lo and behold, who walks out of the restaurant? None other than James Corden. And I'm like, oh my god, celebrity sighting, I've got it in my head. Um, as I'm approaching, I hear James Corden yelling at this busboy. Um, in my head, I'm like, oh, oh my God, what's going on? So being the nosy little Nancy I am, I obviously beelined straight for them down the street. Um, and I overhear the busboy telling James Corden that Little Doms is closed right now. It's closed right now. This also resulted in the comedian being banned from the place, but it seems like this is not the first establishment where he showed his true colors. In a now viral TikTok, Becky narrated her encounter with Corden, and let's just say it's not the best one because it also involved yelling at a busboy in front of a famous Los Angeles Risto. She also pointed out how she can't forget the incident because it greatly impacted her to see how a celeb behaves when the cameras aren't rolling. Um, and I don't think James Corden is sorry because if he was really sorry, he would have apologized to the server and not the owner of the restaurant. At the end of the video, she spilled more tea and mentioned how she didn't believe that the comedian felt guilty about what he did because he didn't apologize to the server in the first place. Soon enough, comments about James Corden's rude attitude flooded the internet, and it's pretty obvious not everyone is happy about how he acted. One fan in the comments said, unless you're a celeb on his gap show, James Corden has no patience for you. Another added, James has a reputation in general. His former co-stars, Kunio Samlisdal, had cut ties with him. Well, I guess it's safe to say this is not an isolated case and James really has to do something with his personality outside his studio, right? That's it for today's video and see you.